This is the second video that we're going to be doing. This is on the raw materials and the quality of the materials that were used to produce these binders. Uh, this is uh, the side-by-side -side comparison of the 11 by 17 one inch vinyl binder. And so we got the Ruby Paulina brand, the Stride, uh, two brands from Cardinal. So we're going to, I've already chopped these up and made some little notes inside here so we can kind of see what we're looking at. Uh, the chipboard, what I'm referencing to is here. It's the inside board used to make the vinyl binder. Uh, Ruby Paulina uses a 120 point chipboard. Uh, the colored gauge vinyl, this right here is a 12 gauge color vinyl. Clear overlay is a 7 gauge and it has a 1 inch angle D ring. Uh, really a great product for the money. Uh, when compared to the other three, it fits right in there in the, about the number two position. We really like this. Uh, great, great product. Next in the list is the Cardinal. They're a black binder. It has a 125 point chipboard. Uh, just a little bit thicker than the Ruby Paulina, but not by much. 13 gauge color vinyl. Uh, it really doesn't have a clear overlay. There is a small label holder there on the spine. And it, it features a one inch easy open locking slant D ring. So, uh, this was the most, by far, the most expensive of all of four binders. And uh, we could tell mainly because of the, the extra thickness in, in the chipboard. Next, we have the other Cardinal brand. This is their, they call Clearview. It has a 120 point chipboard, the exact same as the Ruby Paulina has an 11 gauge color vinyl, five and a half gauge clear overlay. Uh, the overlay on this one is nice and also got a one inch angle D ring. Just a standard ring. Pretty good product. By far the cheapest out of the entire, out of all four is the Stride Quick Fit. And it's noticeably so uh, because of the quality of the materials that were used in producing the binder. They, they went down quite a bit. They're using a 115 point chipboard. They're using a nine gauge color vinyl and a seven gauge clear overlay. Uh, it's important to note that this seven gauge clear overlay is also smooth, where the other ones that have clear overlay has an orange peel texture. Other material they use is they used a locking D-ring. So it has a two point opening mechanism. I'll show, the, show that over to you again. So, uh, to unlock this one, you would press it down once and you could either open the rings here or you could just push them down all the way and they pop open. You know, some people like the locking rings. We're not a, a big personal fans of them because a lot of people don't realize they're locking rings. So the first thing they're going to want to do is come over here and start pulling on the rings. Well, you do that over a long enough period of time, you start, you know, stretching that out, you know, over and over again. Uh, they also put an inside vinyl pocket here, which is a pretty neat little feature if that's something that you're looking for. Well, hope you enjoyed the side-by-side -side comparison uh, in regards to the raw materials used. Looks like everyone uh, does a pretty pretty decent job in, in providing them. My overall favorite is going to be the Ruby Paulina. Uh, one for the quality of chipboards they put inside there and two because of just the construction. Thanks and enjoy the video.